the vibration lays in for um, the Scorpion Sun Moon Horizon. I want to say thank, uh, happy Thanksgiving to all who are out there who's going to celebrate Thanksgiving. Thank you for being back. Thank you for um, the wonderful support that you, Scorpion, has been giving me. And um, thank you for all the message that you have left behind. Thank you so much. I want to say to each and every person out there, this is going to be a week of... Uh, uh, the two first days for you guys are going to be very good because um, that is the last energy vibration for you scorpion um, for the year 2016 for you guys because you're still uh, vibrating in 2016 you have now began the year so for the two scorpions that is having birthday on the 20th and the 21st what is happening whatever the situation was um, there is a victorious end to this situation there is a huge victorious end to this uh, situation so whatever whatever that has been going on there is going to be a very victorious end I'm asking all you scorpions to please donate to um, the fate outreach church because they are um, they are going to support the homeless and the unfortunate on um, Thanksgiving Day, which is on Thursday. On Thursday, you have the energy of the magician in the reverse form. That is okay because what that is saying is that you don't need that energy on this day. You need to relax. You need to relax. Okay. Um, the week begins from the 20th until the 26th. Um, the energy of the week is a water energy which is very good for you scorpion and the zodiac energy is water and fire you have the energy of the four of swords in reverse so you know if you were in the sense of taking you know some rest or that sort of a thing you're going to realize um, that you really don't need to, to do that you can now start get together and facing the things that you need to face okay so let's look at this week and see what other energies are coming up for this week because on Friday you are going to be victorious and successful in a situation whatever that situation is because you don't have a lot of people working with in this week because you have a lot of major arcanas you have death and transformation on Monday on Tuesday you have the energy vibration of the hangman on on um, on Thursday you have the energy of the magician in the reverse form and you know you don't need the energy of the magician because you know you're coming out of a situation that is very good so let's look at whatever messages that are here whatever conflicts that is has come to an end whatever the conflict was has come to an end the number 13 is here twice whoever the king of ones is is a real ridiculous character and you have to be looking out for that you are at the end of a situation something that has transpired in your life whatever has happened this conflicts has come to an end so there was a conflict that was going on sometimes you're aware of it sometimes you're not aware of it whatever that was going on this conflict has come to an end and somebody didn't win and they're very unhappy okay because they lied and they are not aware of certain things in certain aspect whatever this conflict was it is now ended as we move forward we have the energy of the hangman and on Tuesday the last day of your zodiac energy vibration you finally finally receive and bring back your true inner light and this is good so whatever the situation is whatever that was plain you had the eight of Pentacles and what happened is that whatever you were lost you were in a loss and now you're finally finding your true inner light and this is good because um, this is going to help you I'm sorry I have to drink cause my throat my I've been going all day I've been going all day my throat is my stem goes because um, 
you talk for an eye on this thing, you come home and you do these readings and my throat is just, mm, my voice is going. Okay, so we're looking at the crowning of your week and the crowning of your week um, is, is strange for the women. Remember that your number energy vibration is going to be the number 13. Okay, for the women, it's actually a situation and it's going to affect you cancer women is in the reverse you scorpion women are in the reverse so there is a debt and transformation to you scorpion whatever you have done um there's a debt and transformation that means um an ending is coming to something in your life for you cancers so you cancer women out there because you're in a reverse form and the debt and transformation this could be a debt a ending to your work a ending to something in your life a ending to someone in your life um, someone um, could be passing away so you cancer women and this is for people who are over the age of 40 they come an ending to something in your life and this ending I can look at it but I don't like to speak about the transition to the spirit world a lot of people do not like it because they say that I shouldn't do it I don't think people have the right to tell me because I channel so if this message needs to come out there are other people who wants to know about this message so anyway to um, you know bring this but you cancer women especially over the age of 40 there is coming an end to a situation in your life and this end to the situation in your life have to do with some of you for work some of you um, you know um, is uh, people and situation that is around you as we move forward we have the energy of the magician and the king of wands whatever this king of wands was doing um, his whatever he was using to do it whatever um, accessible or whoever he was asking to do certain things it is now ended um, so if you have a relation with someone who is an Aries and a Leo or a Sagittarius there comes an end to this situation whatever power that he have whatever um, whoever he was using for certain things there come an end to it this is the ending okay so wh however he was reigning his power there come an end whenever the magician is in reverse whatever power you thought you had over someone is no longer there okay so think about it and look around and see who is this person who is an Aries a Leo or a Sagittarius that has had an effect in your life this person has no more power it has ended for this person as we move forward there is a victory and a success on Friday there is a huge victory and success on Friday and this three of coins is a very very um, um, good thing because it's a victory of success and you're moving away and you are going to be starting something different so whatever is ending in your life because this week is going to end especially for the women it's going to end a lot of stuff in your life so um, some people can have ending in their work some people can have endings in relationships some people can have endings um, with a group of people and on Friday this ending there is going to um, something new is going to be starting um, and this this is really an end because you have come to the end of something so whatever um, injustice I don't think it's really injustice is something that you got yourself in is coming to an end it is you who have um, played this thing whoever is this Queen of Cups you scorpion women or all the scorpion women have gotten yourself in something and now it's coming to an end you have the energy of the ten of swords and worrying um, 
a ten of swords um, whatever has transpired you are not worrying anymore you are just accepting um, whatever happened and you uh, you, ne you need to accept it because you have caused this on yourself okay I'm sorry but this is a message that I'm getting some of you have caused this on yourself because I'm not seeing anything because you have um, you have overdone yourself with something some of you not all of you because this is a general reading but for the persons um, that you know was stabbed in the back and it was injustice you're not worrying about it you're just moving on for the rest of the people who did something to cause this to happen um, is going to be um, very worried okay the page of cups that um, you have the four of cups which the four of cups is that you have you know a regrets you're sitting down and thinking about what you have done because it costs you and someone else a great deal of energy and you realize and you're sitting down and thinking oh my god if I had just known and um, whatever the love that people were showing you it's now in the reverse form because obviously some of you have done something um, to someone else that was injustice and you wanted the limelight and now you're seeing that the limelight is on you but as you have done something to someone else that was not really nice and now people have turned away and turned the love away from you because you have done something injustice to this part to someone else so you could receive the limelight and people are turning away from you and you know, you're sitting down there thinking what have I done I wish I had not done something like that and and, and this is it um, because the women the men it's a good week for the men um, I have to say because for you cancer men it's a good week because your life is kind of um, flowing in this week because it's like the last energy vibration for you cancer men and it's like kind of very flowing but as you look at this week the focus is all on the feminine aspect the women so a lot of stuff the men are going to be victorious in a lot of stuff the women are going to try to find themselves to see you know what have I done and this week is a focus on women over 40 so for the rest for the young people it's gonna be a nice flowing week it's actually the last dregs of your birthday and it is within the sort of the cups and that sort of a thing so um, you are going to um, like see that things are changing and these things are changing um, in 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 a positive way for most of you um, cancer um, most of you cancer people so this is actually good but for the older women um, over the age of 40 you have done something to someone and it comes back to bite you in the butt okay because um, whenever you um, decide um, to work against someone because you want um, a situation in your life and you work against someone and try to um, let someone fall in the hole for you know for a time you're going to be looking as if oh yeah you you know the spotlight is on you and the love is coming into you but once people find out what you have done and especially in this time whenever the the, 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 the wheel of karma is going so fast so um, once you do something to someone that is not positive it's gonna come back to you but once you do positive things then it comes back that's how fast the energy vibration on this hurt is going and that's how fast the wheel of fortune is going and this is what is actually happening you did someone to someone to get the limelight and now um, you fall in a trap you fall in a trap because um, you thought that you were going to have the limelight for a very long time but um, you have you have did yourself and, and and this is what is happening you've really outdid yourself and it's coming back to affect you and it is really and whoever this um this person was this leo um, um sagittarius or 
Leo Sagittarius or Aries person who help you to give you the ammunition he has no power anymore and he can't help you so you're right back at square one where you were and apparently the same person that you work against is the same person that this person let you fall in a trap for yourself so you are in a loss here and this is only for the, the women that is 40 and over for the rest of you this transition whatever conflicts that was there is going to be ending um, people are um, finding their true inner light and moving forward and trying to build something in their lives uh, um, whoever that you had to work with who was someone who you know have the power that he thought that he has the energy of the magician it's no longer there it's taken away from him and um, most of you especially the younger people are going to have a victorious success over certain things that is happening in your life which is you know extremely good whoever has been uh, stabbed was stabbed in the back this thing is going to be cleared up and uh, whoever tried to um, you know break down someone else uh, to get the light and the positive energy it's going to be something else but it's not going to go your way you're going to really sit and think about what you have done we're working with the light work because energy just just came up um, for another sign and this is coming up again and we're going to look at it but we're asking um, what is it that the scorpions should know and the second rate of wisdom and this every time that uh, a sign shows up that someone did something you know against someone else the second ray of wisdom comes up and that is saying to you that you need to look within and look at yourself and ask for a forgiveness when the second way of wisdom come up that mean you need to look at yourself and ask for wisdom the alchemist multiply is saying that you need to learn to manifest um, and certain things in certain aspect but the second ray of wisdom is saying to you look at what you have done you need um, to ask for forgiveness for what you have done and there's the angels behind you and if you open up your arms and ask the angel to forgive you for whatever that has transpired you will have a forgiveness okay whatever that has happened um, you need to learn from this okay because it's something that you did to someone else and this is why um, the second ray came in to say um, ask for forgiveness and ask that person to forgive you for what you have done and we're working with the Oracle of the E energy of the Oracle of the he is here and it is a silver lining in everything there is a silver lining okay so whatever has transpired and sometimes people think but in everything there is a silver lining and it said it only looks like disruption in reality everything is fine everything in fact is beyond fine underneath appearances is a silver gold and a platinum lining enjoy okay so obviously someone really messed up someone else and this is coming up and this is you know working for you and this is affecting you and um, here you need to see that um, whatever you do to someone else is coming back I want to say thank you for being here and wishing you a wonderful week please like share these videos and for the people who have been doing positive energy a lot of positive things are going to be coming back to you I love you my scorpions you're like one of my favorite um, people um, you scorpions I love you so much namaste until next time